Earlier today, Seven Investigates sat down with Boise Mayor Lauren McLean almost two weeks after she asked the police chief to resign. Former Chief Ryan Lee stepped down after my colleague Alexandra Duggan published a story about nine officers filing complaints against him with the Office of Police Accountability, or OPA. After looking into the complaints, the OPA recommended Lee be placed on paid leave while a third party investigated. The mayor tells us a contractor did investigate, but the mayor didn't place Lee on leave during that time because he didn't violate policy or commit a crime. She also didn't place him on leave while Idaho State Police investigated criminal allegations against him. McLean admitted to us today she learned about issues officers had with the chief back in February. So we asked why she requested he step down so many months later. She said she, as his boss, worked with him on his communication and management style, and so did the police union but their efforts weren't working. Then KTVB's story came out and the mayor said she didn't think he could lead successfully when those personnel issues, those private personnel issues became public. Why not just take that step and place him on leave until you got that answer from the third party? Sure, well, and that gets back to when you've got 400 folks in a department and nine people that have made complaints. Imagine the impact that would have on any department if five folks from Parks and Rec um, made complaints to HR about the director that I then put a director on leave because five folks made complaints. You need to invest and review those complaints, investigate whether or not they, via they contain things that violate policy and procedure or law, and then make the decision. I think it, it's difficult though to compare sort of like apples and oranges, like one is public safety, and, and then perhaps if there was wrongdoing, anything the chief does is then questioned, right? If you don't place him on leave and something's found, he'd violate policies or perhaps even a crime because he was under investigation for potential criminal charges as well. If that's found to be true and it's founded and then you didn't place him on leave, isn't that more of a liability for the city? If it had been found to be true, I would have taken that step. Um, as... McLean says that third party also found the city needed to create policies and procedures to build accountability within BPD, especially when it comes to department leadership like the chief. So moving forward, she says council will try to clarify where exactly officers should take their complaints and who investigates them. Is it human resources with the city? Is it police internal affairs or is it the OPA? We'll have much more from our interview with the mayor this Sunday on the News at 10.